hi guys welcome and welcome back to my channel so as i can see by the title today i'm doing a daily makeup routine um so i think we should get started because it's not that early but it's not that late and i woke up just to do this video um so i already moisture i already washed moisturized my face i haven't primed yet but um yeah, that's what I've done so far. If y'all want another products, I'll probably put them on the screen or something. Um, but the first thing I always start off with is my eyebrows. I'm going to show y'all what products I use and like the brushes and everything. Um, I use the NYX Tame and Frame Brow Pomade. It looks like this. And then I use, for my brows, I use this angled brush from e.l.f. You can use any angled brush. A concealer brush. And then a spoolie, if you use any spoolie. And for concealer, I use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and the shade 15. So I'm going to do my eyebrows off, cam off camera because um, that's a different like video that like people have been, been requesting. So I'm going to do my eyebrows off camera. I'll be right back and I'll show you all the rest of my makeup. Okay, so I'm back. Okay, so I'm back and I'm done with my eyebrows. What is that? This is how they came out. Mm, I could do better, but it doesn't matter. Um, so next thing I do is primer. After I do my eyebrows, I do primer. I did put primer here, like in my T spot, when whenever before I concealer, like before I conceal my brows. So we're good. Um, so I use this Maybelline Baby Skin Primer. It's an instant pore eraser and it works well. Um, it's cheap. It's like three dollars, maybe four. I don't even know. So I put it here. I already put some in my nose. So I'm gonna focus it where, like, I've struggled with acne before, which is like on my cheeks. Basically, my whole face, but like mostly on my cheek. So I put it everywhere. If y'all hear talking in the background is my brother if i put it everywhere just think that i've been breaking out in my chin a lot so i'm gonna focus it there too so now that primer is on <coughs> i really don't do a lot for face make for face makeup um but i do like just like put concealer i don't put foundation but i put concealer in like the areas where i have like pimples or like scars or like you know um i do my under under eyes a lot and then whenever i do do foundation i use this one which is the wet and wild photo focus foundation this is in the shade golden beige but i'm not gonna use it today because um I'm, i don't want to do foundation yeah. so i get my thingy and I put it under my eyes, just like that. So then I get my beauty blender. This There's water inside this. This is not a setting spray because I'm like, but um, I get my beauty blender. This is from Equal Tools, or if not, I use the Real Technique ones. Um, I use this one and I put, like, I just wet it. It's already damp, but I like to, like, always put water. And then I start blending. I barely bought this one yesterday. I barely bought this beauty sponge yesterday. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of iffy about it. I like the real technique ones. more i feel like the real the the equal tools one like oh, I, I don't know what move your freaking feet out of my camera how about huh? move your feet out of the camera 
But yeah, see, I like this one better. I might use this one for powder then. I don't like how this blends. So, I blend and I blend and I blend. Okay, now I'm done blending my concealer. Um, I forgot to put some in my eye lid. I'm gonna just put the remainder of this. Okay, just like that. Um, now I'm gonna just put somewhere like I sh like I have like like you could see um some pimples or something. Mm, I'm putting right here. I'm breaking out right here. Like there's head of pimples. Maybe because I've been sad. So I put them there. My nose, you could see one, and then right here. And then that's it. So, that's literally all I do. I don't know if you could see it. Um, it's right there, right there. My chin, my nose, and then like right there. This part of my face is the one that I break out the most. So, that's why I, I put like three dots there. So, I'm going to put more so I could cover it more. I don't know why I'm breaking out there. It's fun. I'm telling you, I'm, like, it's probably because I've been sad. Like, can you see the little bumps? They weren't there before. Like, they weren't there, like, two days ago. And I've been really sad, like, these past days. These past two days. So, maybe that's why. I remember whenever school started, I wasn't, I wasn't really breaking out. But, um, I didn't really break out. Ignore that. I didn't really break out. Um, but then something happened. Like throughout my sophomore year. It was like September. And I started breaking out so bad. Because I got so sad. Um, I started breaking out in my cheeks a lot. Like I had hella cheek acne. Like that shit was hell not. It was so ugly. But it was because I was sad. And like I cried almost every day. And that's what's happening now. Like I've, I've been crying almost every day and I think that's why I'm breaking out but I don't know so I have to see how to fix it because I don't want to break out again and it's a dumb reason to be sad like but you know everybody has their reasons so with the remainder I'm gonna just put it here I don't put nothing on my on my forehead because i feel like my forehead is darker than the rest of my face so now i get this airspun powder and i'm gonna put it on i'm gonna get the this one the eco beauty blender and i'm gonna just put it everywhere where i put concealer which is here So just like that, and then like right here, and then here, I crease a lot like in my nose area, so like there, so like I try to put as much as possible there, because I do crease a lot, and then I put some in my nose, and then here. I'm gonna put some in my forehead, like here, where I like did this. Okay, just like that. So now that I'm done with that, while I let that like set it, set in, I take like I give some color back into my skin. So I don't use bronzer. I use I use contour as bronzer. Because I don't know how to do contour. So I take this palette. It's the Morphe 8H palette. 
pretty sure. Yeah, it's a Morphe 8 a palette palette palette. And I take like can y'all see? I take this this one, it's called Donut. I take that one, the lightest shade. And with this brush is a wet and wild um contour brush. I like to um just bring some color back in to my skin. Yeah, see, I don't know how to do it, but I try my best. Somebody needs to teach me. Oh, weird. I can see this one. So I do that. And the other side. If y'all have some tips on how y'all could help me do this better, please comment. How would I duplicate? Yeah. Okay, now that I feel like it doesn't look that bad. I take another big fluffy brush just like this one and I blend even more so it doesn't look that harsh because I'm pretty sure it does. I don't know a lot about makeup so um, I blend this side too. Okay, just like that. And now with Beauty Blender, I do the line under the thing to this side. So now I, I did the line. Now I'm gonna like brush out just the other powder, not this powder, because I'm gonna let that like just sit there. So I get this fluffy brush and I start like um sitting, I mean. Putting the powder away. This brush is from Profusion, something like that. I don't have, I don't like, I don't kind of buy high end makeup just because, like, I can't afford it, first of all. And it do be expensive, like. For no reason and some products work uh, some products work like good like like them how do i explain it some products work like as good as them some products work as good as them yeah that's what i was trying to say so now that i did that i like to do something to my nose just so my nose doesn't like that you know so i take the same shade from the palette which is that one called donut and i just do like something on my nose like just like that not rough or anything just like that and then here at the bottom And then like here. So now I get the beauty blender once more and I do lines right here. Okay, just like that and then with the tip of it. Oh, fuck. Put some like right there and then on the here. The bridge. Just like that. It's not contouring or anything because I told you I cannot contour. But it's something I did to my nose just so it doesn't look that bad. So now, now that we're done with this palette, we can put it away. Um, so now that I did all that. I like to start like on my eyes. I don't do nothing on my eyes except like lashes and stuff. Uh, sometimes though, 
or do put like some shade on like some like um what do you call it some like bronzer or like an, uh, an eyeshadow palette i mean eyeshadow palette some eyeshadow that like goes with like my eye color so i usually put that one or if not i just put bronzer i put this one but i feel like today we don't need it Mm, maybe okay i'm gonna just put this one so with the same brush that we did our nose can get it and we could just put it there doesn't even have to be like that blended just has to be there just so your eyes don't look that bad or that white for my eyes because i don't know if y'all are going to my makeup routine so just like that it makes a slight difference not a big one but it still makes a difference so i can't feel any better than this put it on the other eye too i've been wanting to buy eyeliner but I, every time i go to the store i forget like yesterday i went to walmart and i forgot to buy eyeliner like i bought everything except eyeliner i didn't so. so now we leave it oh we leave it just like that <coughs> so now that we're done with that we start off i start off with um my eyelashes so i get my eyelash color i get my eyelash color which is like just an eye, regular eyelash filler and then i get my mascara this mascara is um the liquid lash extensions mascara by thrive cosmetics i don't know if you have heard that before um i got it in my ipsy bag um but it's really good it's become my favorite mascara and i'm and i i'm almost running out of it so i want to buy like the big one now that we're done with that I'm gonna get my eyelashes. Okay, so these are the lashes I'm gonna use today. Um, I have a discount code on them. Um, the company that sent me is called Hairfin. I'll put it somewhere on the screen, somewhere there. Um, and my code is Rosa with two A's, twenty nine. So y'all can like get money off, or I think it's like buy two get one free, or like something like that. But I also posted them on my Instagram if y'all wanna go check them out. Um, the company again is called Hairfin, hair and then F E I N. So these are in a style. Um, I forgot Besame. Yeah, I think they're in a the style Besame, and they're so pretty. Um, so I'm gonna use them today. Um, I get my pinzas, <sighs> and then and my eyelash glue. I use the dual dual eyelash glue this one and then like any pizza so get the glue i barely bought this glue yesterday so this is my first time trying it out because the other one i ran out of look with these nails i can't do anything so i get the glue okay so i wait for the glue to get like blue because that's how i know like it's done and I put it on. So now I put on both of my lashes. And they look like this. They're really pretty. And they feel like pretty. You know? So now what I'm going to do is my lower lash mascara. And I do it with the same mascara. Oh wait. First, let me wipe this off. I'm going to wipe off the powder now. And this powder as well. And I do my lower lash. So now that I'm done with everything, I set everything in place with the Tarte setting spray. I just put it all over my face. What? Now I clean my lips because I don't like when my lips look like that. So I wipe my lips and everything. 
so now all I have left to do is like set my eyebrows and then like highlight and then that's it so the highlight that I use mm, the highlight that I'm gonna use today Enjoy, uh, I'm which one should I use sure. okay there's still like highlight left like even though I can't see it there is highlight left but I think I'm gonna use the Anastasia one so I took out whenever I went to school whenever I went to school I always like used to take a highlight just in case so I use I'm gonna, I'm gonna use that one and I'm gonna just you know okay so now I put highlight only on this side and I'm gonna keep putting it on it looks like that it doesn't look too like you know it looks like natural so i'm gonna put it here as, as well and i put them on my nose on my nose i don't put it on with that one and on my eye on my brow bone either I, on my nose i use this one i love nose highlight I always put a highlight in my inner mm -hmm. corner, mm -hmm. but I usually use a liquid highlight, but I feel like today I want to use powder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this brush and then put water in it. And then with the rest, I'll just put it like on top of my nose and on my bridge because I'm playing it bro. Like, I love nose highlight. Blend it like a little bit. Okay, so after everything, I sit in my eyebrows and I use the Benefit Gimme Brow, um, like eyebrow thingy. So it's just, it's the small one. I, I'm pretty sure it's a simple one. I got it in my Ipsy bag. So I use that. And then mm -hmm. on the front, so the hairs don't go anywhere. Just like that. It works pretty good. Why? Why? So I put it on just like that. And it just stays like my eyebrows stay in place all day. <clears throat> now, um, the only thing that's left is lips. For lips, I don't really do anything like that much, you know. Um, I use this um NYX um lip liner. It's in the shade Stockholm or something like that. I don't even know, but it's the NYX one, and I just outline my lips. It's like the same color as my lips, so I just outline them. It gives the it gives me like a little like tint of like pink, like more pinkish, you know. So just like that, I outline it, and then I used to put um chapstick, but yesterday I went to the store, like I told y'all, and I bought this lipstick. It's really cute. It's I bought this lipstick, and it's really cute. Like it comes in a really cute like thingy. It's from Wet and Wild. It was like oh one eighty nine. I fucked it up already <sighs> okay whatever it looks like this and it's really pretty it's in the shade closed off that's how it's called so i'm gonna try it on today because it looks pretty so 
Mm-hmm. It's like an like a um what you call it? Like a natural type lipstick. I don't know. Mm-hmm. I'm telling y'all bro, like I don't know shit about makeup but when I saw this um color I liked it because it like goes with your lips, with my lips. I know that's really cute. So that's what I use. Just like that. And it looks pretty. This is my first time using it. And it looks pretty. So now that is it. I usually set once more. So that's what I'm gonna do. I set once more and then I just let it dry. And then that's it. That's my daily makeup. Then I like just do my hair and stuff. So I think I'm gonna do my hair and I'll come back to y'all whenever like the makeup like is ready and everything. Uh, also, I wanted to show y'all this necklace. Um, from Custom Gold. Um, I don't I don't know if I have a code with it. If I do, I'll probably put it on the screen or something. But I have I this seen. necklace. It's from Custom Gold on Instagram. I put their Instagram in like the screen. Um, it's really pretty. I ordered two more. Like, they sent me two more. But this is an infinity one. And you can put, like, two names or, like, three. Um, mine says Rosa, Kendrick, and Johan. Because those are my friends' names. Um, so, it's really pretty. I should go check them out. Um, it's not that expensive, to be honest. Um, and it comes in a really cute package. It comes like this. So, I think I should go sh- check them out on Instagram. Also, on TikTok, they really want to, like, build up their, like, page and stuff like get recognized more so y'all should go check them out um and like i said i'll be back to y'all whenever like my hair is ready so see y'all until then i probably look more pretty maybe okay bye